Hi guys and welcome to Tech Based. In this video, we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the dev channel, which is the build 23541. This build is a smaller build with not a lot of new additions, but with a few fixes and of course some known issues that we're going to talk about in this video. So if you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the Tech Based channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. So first of all, of course, I need to remind you that the September config update was spotted in some velocity features on the Canary dev and other builds and also Sino Panther on Twitter noticed a Windows configuration update that has been added to the MUS update handlers.dll file. It's not clear that this will be the 23H2 configuration update but of course it's still pretty interesting. You're gonna have some tweets linked in the pinned comment below from Sino Panther and also Phantom Ocean 3 so you can see more info about this. Now particular to this build regarding the start menu, rich thumbnail previews or tooltips for cloud files and the recommended on the start menu and the ability to right click to share on these files which rolled out with build 23511 may temporarily disappear for some Windows Insiders in the dev channel. Regarding fixes for the taskbar Microsoft fixing issue where dragging app icons in the taskbar may sometimes lead to an explorer.exe crash. Regarding search on the taskbar they fixed an issue where sometimes the tooltip when mousing over the search box wouldn't match the current search highlight. And regarding dev drives Microsoft fixed an issue where it wasn't possible to paste the folder path to mount into the dialog when creating a new dev drive. Now of course in this update we also have the Microsoft Store update with the new Game Pass page that will basically allow you to explore and subscribe to PC Game Pass or Game Pass Ultimate through the dedicated page and of course you can go to library in the Microsoft Store and then get updates to install all the newest updates for the Microsoft Store and also the new Paint app that Microsoft has worked on and they basically added a new function also on the dev channel which will allow you to remove the background of an image. Right now the feature is not really useful in my opinion because only removing removes the background of an image. It doesn't create a transparent background. It also doesn't allow you to save it as PNG with a transparent background, but I'm hoping that Microsoft will add this in the near future. I'm also going to mention a few known issues. For example, icons on the desktop may show as generic white pages rather than their proper icons. There's also an issue where the progress wheel icon will get stuck in the file explorer tab even though the folder has finished loading. Also changing the sort order of folders doesn't persist if you navigate away and back from the folder. And there is also a known issue that Windows Copilot preview is not available in some regions. These are some known issues that will be fixed in future builds. So this is basically everything that there is to it in the latest dev channel build. As you can see the builds are pretty small now, only fixes, only small improvements because we are closing into the Windows 11 23H2 release. Microsoft is focusing on fixing all the known issues, all the things that need to be fixed and later on after the Windows 11 23H2 release Microsoft will start working on new features and new improvements for the Windows operating system. So if you enjoyed this video please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from tech base until next time have a nice day.